So you have a job interview coming up and you're trying to decide what to wear or maybe what not to wear. In this video, you'll learn how to dress properly for your next job interview in three simple tips. And as always, if you stay with me until the end, I have a special bonus just for you. Hi there, if we've never met before, I'm Heather Austin from ProfessorAustin.com and on this channel I teach simple solutions to help you build a business or launch a career you love. So if you're new here, consider hitting the subscribe button down below. Before we nail down the appropriate clothing for your next job interview, there's a few things to keep in mind. First, research the company culture before planning your interview attire. Determine if the interview you're going on is in a more professional environment or a more casual environment. Either way, you'll want to plan your clothing ahead of time so that you can focus on being prepared to impress your interviewer. The second thing is to coordinate an outfit that is modern and on trend. This will demonstrate your attention to detail and show that you are current in your industry. And then third, always make sure your clothing fits. An outfit that is either too big or too small suggests improper planning and may leave you tugging or pulling the entire time. The last thing you wanna worry about when answering interview questions is your attire. So let's jump into how to dress properly for your next job interview. Tip number one, dress professionally. If the interview you're going on is more formal, wear a suit. Suits in a darker color are probably going to be the best bet. Maybe something in a dark gray or a navy. These colors actually fare better than black, which is a little bit harsh and overpowering for a job interview. For women, make sure you wear a skirt that is knee length and a blouse under your jacket that has a conservative neckline. To bring more personality into your attire, try a blouse with a small pop of color, but nothing too bright. For men, wear a white, a pale blue, or a pinpoint button-up shirt under your suit jacket. To add personality, wear a tie with subtle color. Avoid ties with themes, but to bring in more authority to your look, try a tie with a small pattern. So here's a bonus tip when it comes to selecting a suit. If a new suit is not in your budget, try visiting your local Goodwill. Chances are they'll have a slightly used suit there that you can purchase and have tailored for less than a new suit would cost. Now let's talk about if your interview is going to be more casual. If the interview you're going on is more casual, you'll still want to dress professionally. However, you may not need a suit. For women, try dress pants with either a cardigan or a blazer over your blouse. You can also wear a chic and stylish knee length dress with a classy jacket. For men, wear khakis with a dress shirt and try some type of sweater or vest to layer your look. Tip number two, don't overdo it. Some experts recommend not wearing any cologne or perfume at all. However, I still like to smell good in an interview. So if you choose to wear cologne or perfume, wear it very subtly, almost like the interviewer wouldn't be able to smell it unless they came in for a hug. You don't wanna overpower them with a fragrant smell. Also, don't wear a lot of jewelry. For women, stick to earrings that are no bigger than the size of a nickel. And for men, remove your earrings altogether if you can. Instead, stick to a nice watch or a wedding band if you have one. Now, when it comes to your hair and makeup, less is always more. Keep makeup and nail polish neutral and minimal. And if you have long hair, Pull it back in a chic style. This leads us to tip number three. Pay special attention to your footwear. Believe it or not, the shoes you wear say a lot about you and will make a significant first impression. For women, stick with a classic leather pump, preferably closed toe, and if you're comfortable wearing skin tone nylons, you can add those as well. Stay away from stilettos or shoes that are too tall. This can cheapen your look and the last thing you wanna have happen is to trip over your shoes. Trust me, I'm short, I love heels, but when it comes to an interview, you wanna keep it conservative. For men, wear dress shoes that match your outfit. 
try some type of leather shoe that is either slip on or lace up. And avoid wearing sneakers or shoes that look worn. There you have it guys, my three best interview attire tips. For all of those who are still watching and hung with me until the end, I have a special bonus just for you. It's the simple guide to dressing for your next job interview. It's an easy to follow one page cheat sheet that you can download today and reference when you're planning your next job interview outfit. I'll go ahead and link it up below. So I have a question for you. What tip would you add to this list of something to wear or maybe something not to wear in your next job interview. Feel free to comment and connect with others below. And if you know someone that might benefit from this video, please feel free to share it with them. Don't forget to hit the like button below. And if you're new here, consider subscribing. And I'll see you guys in the next video.